want to know why I really, 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 really like guys like Gary Brecca, Dave Asprey, Paul Saladino, is because they actually walk the talk. If you look at them, they're healthy. They're willing to do what it's going to take to make themselves a better human. They're willing to say, well, my old beliefs are old beliefs. And we found through research or found through you know, uh, trial and error with our patients or with myself that that doesn't, or they said, well, that stuff works for other people, but it doesn't work for me because I have a genetic snip or you know, that stuff works for me, but it doesn't work for other people or that stuff's worked for 50% of my patients and this stuff's worked for 50% of my patients because they're willing to customize it and they're willing to figure out what's best for the patient versus just give like overall blanket statements. Because that's the thing, right? I don't believe in veganism. I just don't. I've not seen it do well. Although I'll say this, I'm talking in general. There's a few people I've seen be vegans for 20 years and whatever reason, they're actually really good. It's just really rare. But that's why I look at those three guys right there. Mindy Pels is another one, Dr. Mindy Pels. She's another great provider because she finds out that if you're gonna fast, for instance, fast, fast like a girl. The reason she came out with that book is because women have to fast differently than men do, especially when they're on their menstrual cycle. They're gonna crave certain carbs. And there's a time you should have carbs and a time you shouldn't have carbs, but you can still be keto, right? So you just have to find a way to what works for your population and not just say one size fits all. And I like people like that that are willing to do what's best for their patients versus just blanket statement of do this for everybody.